Hi there ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to my channel. Today we are talking about this. This is a GPS tracker from CSAP. Roll the intro. Yeah, we're in the garage with my Norden. And the Norden is getting a tracker. I never thought, I um, never crossed my mind to have a tracker on my bike. But when CSAP reached out to me and said that they will send this for free to try out, I couldn't say no. So uh, this tracks your bike 24 7. And there's a lot of features on uh, this tracker. So I will go through some of them, but not all. Um, but there are some things here I'm going to use. And uh, in the box you get the GPS tracker with wires so you can connect it to your battery. You also get a quick installation guide. And with this tracker you have a two year warranty. There's no contract and there's no monthly fees when you buy this you're finished no more costs so that's really nice and you need your phone because you have to download the sys app from the app store i have already done that i've uh, installed the app and uh, registered and when you have registered you have to put in a 15 digit code and uh, it's called an imei code and when you have done that the app is ready, so uh, now we can install the GPS tracker to the bike. So the GPS tracker is installed on Norden. I put my uh, unit way behind here under the passenger seat. Just ran the cable beside here and connected it to the battery. I will take some zip ties here to secure it. And uh, But I think it fits really good behind here. I forgot to mention that this is waterproof and it can also run disconnected for three hours. So yeah, let's get the seat back on again and see how this works. So the GPS tracker is connected to the bike. So we're just going to go into the SIS app and have a look. And just, as you can see, uh, now it shows the voltage on my battery, so it means it's connected to the bike. There's lots of features on this app. Uh, I won't go through all the features, but uh, if you head on over to the SysApp uh, website, I give a link down in the description. You can see all the info you need on this app. And uh, there are especially two things I'm going to use, and that is the battery level and the security because uh, on this you can get push warnings or SMS warnings when you have a low battery you get a crash detection you can get a warning on and uh, device disconnection that means if the tracker is disconnected from your bike you will get a warning on your phone and also motion detection that I think is pretty neat. So if someone is fi fiddling around with your bike or trying to move it, you will get a push or an SMS warning on your phone. And we will try that out in just a few seconds. But other than that, head on over to the SysApp uh, website because this is pretty new to me too. Uh, I know that you also can download your routes as GPX or PNG files, so you can share those with other people, so that's pretty neat too. But uh, I gotta fiddle around with this <laughs> for a little while just to understand everything. So yeah, let's try to move the bike. So now let's check out if this will work. I'm gonna move the bike a little bit around. and see if we're going to get a push warning. And there it is. 
So now we just go into the app and uh, see. And it says, attention, Norden 901, slight movement detected. So this works. I think this is good security for your bike. It won't prevent your bike from getting stolen if you're that unlucky, but you have the opportunity to track the bike. And if the tracker is disconnected, you also get a notice on your phone about that. So uh, I think this is very good security for the bike. And uh, once I get to know the app a little better, there's probably tons of other things I want to use. So I'm going to use the next few days to get to know this app. But uh, if you want to purchase one of these GPS trackers from SysApp, head on over to their website and use the code SIMPLEGUY on two wheels and you will get a 15% discount. And to end it all, I want to thank SysApp to have sent me this for free to use. I'm looking really forward to trying this out in the future. And uh, yeah, that's all for today. See you in the next one, people. Bye.